This is awesome. Yep. Hi, uh, my name is Johnny. I'm Riley Newcomer. Tyler. Molly. Haley. I'm Autumn Grace, and I'm the Children's Ministry intern this summer. And I'm a student intern. I have been spending my summer working in the Com Arts Department. And I'm in Community Partnership. And I'm one of the worship interns. And I'm currently working as a Connect and Grow intern here at Woodman. Something that surprised me was the fact that as soon as I got to the internship, and um, as soon as I got to Colorado Springs, I was just gonna be thrown right into the mix. Um, <laughs> almost immediately, I was doing online services and uh, leading worship um, at Rock Rim and, and just basically everywhere. So coming here, I made the mistake of thinking I had it in the bag a little bit, that I was like, you know, I got this. I'm, I'm gonna come and be able to use everything that I've learned in my classes, but I'm not gonna learn a whole bunch, and good Lord, I was wrong. Um, I mean, literally day one from working with the student ministry team, I just realized how in over my head I actually was and how much there, more there was to running and planning and programming a ministry night um, and the difference between the different ages and what that looks like. But also in that is where I've grown and learned the most is they've taught me so well of how to teach in a way that honors and glorifies God. Women Valley does a great job of preparing us. So like day one, they just throw us right in and like we're given every resource we could possibly need to be successful. And that although we're given so much um, equipment and responsibilities to be successful, it's like, okay, like you're still intern and we still want to teach you and here's a lot of grace. Is your community making you a better person? I think the biggest thing is just how big ministry truly is. Um, my idea of ministry before working at Woodman was that, oh, we have pastors, we have worship leaders, and there's a kid's ministry. But being here has shown me that there's so much more than that. And especially in my department, I was just like, wow, we have graphic designers and videographers and writers, and everybody is working together um, on so many different projects. So ministry is huge. I think what I learned most about ministry is really that it's all about the people. Worship leading is like, that's like a very small part of what an actual worship leader's job is, or at least it should be. But a lot of it is just like talking to people and um, discipling people and being discipled by people. And really in the end, my main job is to be a shepherd and not a performer. Um, I love to be a strong, independent woman. And um, it's been humbling and good to realize like I'm not capable of doing everything on my own, um, and I'm not created to do everything on my own, so it's been sweet to be reminded of my need for community. I love all the people I work with. It's been so fun. I work with like lots of stay-at-home moms who thought they wanted to start working in a church, and so they're so sweet, and they make me food, and it's been such a sweet time. When it's really positive, it's sort of like, wow, there's so much fun uh, But this summer, I've kind of just been asking the Lord what it looks like to have Wow, there's a lot, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I think one of my favorite parts has been just the community, and not just within the internship itself. Like, I have incredible people on my team, um, both within the internship group and outside of it. The church here is outstanding. I, I really, truly enjoy everyone that I've met. I think my favorite part that's not with the interns that I do in Com Arts with definitely be learning about other people's stories and how to portray that. It's so awesome to be able to see what God is doing in other people's lives and then be able to portray that and tell other people and that's how the ripple effect happens. My favorite part about being here this summer has been uh, the community, which <laughs> ironically was my biggest fear coming in. Coming 23 hours away, I was very scared of not knowing anybody. Um, which is ironic because it's almost impossible. Like you have to try to not be in community at Woman. Um, I've just had the opportunity with like, there's three other guys who 
um, right off the bat, like right after the first week, I was just able to immediately like get into like community with these three guys and the four of us have been able just to push each other to like live like Christ and hold each other accountable. <laughs> Man, living in Colorado in the summer is so much fun. Um, a couple weeks ago, I just, I took my day off and I went out and drove out to the middle of nowhere and I went out there for five hours and like all the mountains and the desert sort of climate is so foreign from what I know in Virginia. You know, you have the opportunity to just go wherever you want and everywhere you go just looks insane. <laughs> For someone thinking about interning at Woodman, um, <laughs> strap in. Because you're going to get thrown in at 100 miles an hour and you're going to have to go. Don't come in thinking that you're just going to like coast and you're going to, because you're gonna, whatever you put in, you're going to get out here. And it feels big and how vast ministry is in the church um, and how intimidating it can be. Sometimes like, oh, I'm so incapable of doing this well, but that's exactly where the Lord wants us to not be relying on our gifts, but using them in His strength and knock on the door um, and see what God's up to and don't be afraid to try and to fail and to explore. And you might be thinking, oh, I'm not equipped to do that, I'm not great at that, but that's not true at all. One of the biggest things that I've learned is that it doesn't matter what your gifts are, what your skills are, there is a place for you to use them in ministry, which is just the coolest thing ever. There's a place for you here and you just have to go all in, step into it, and lean into what God is doing. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, that, look at those stages. I love it. You guys looked so natural.